He gets that in the middle and over the field. It's four. Oh, that's a pretty good straight. Nice buying at 150 k's. Plenty of bounce, plenty of carry. As always, uh, the big back left and plenty of bat on that. Opened up the face and ripped it over point for four. Gee, it's a good shot, that, isn't it? Fourth ball. Deliberately goes up over point. And, uh, I was saying earlier, he's swinging the ball back in at good pace. It's not an easy shot to play. Played it beautifully. <laughs> oh, it's gone right through him. Full of a length. Gilchrist not sure to go forward or back. Tate almost gets anything on the pads or then anything wide of off stump. It doesn't matter if it's full or short. You don't get the ball at the stumps. You give him any width. He will unload that big high grip that he uses is there. Check. Oh, he gets it down the ground and past the fielder. Nothing to lose, Gilchrist goes. He's in a pretty good yeah. touch. Nice Nothing wrong with that uh, delivery from uh, Peter Siddle. Was straight, was full. Just outside off stump, maybe just enough width for Gilchrist to go after. That's all he needs. This is great performance by Gilchrist and Hayden to come out and face Tate and Siddle, not having a lot of cricket under your belt, and still look for runs. Short and back he goes. It's a Zach. And what a performance. Talking about Hayden, he hasn't faced the ball yet. He's just a running part. This is skill. Quick bouncer, and he went bang. Oh, Gilly would love that. How good did that feel? It did feel good. The, the wicket, the boys batting first said the wicket is just a fraction holding in the wicket, a little bit slow. A tiny bit of uh, softness on top, so I reckon that just held in the wicket long enough for me to get my back through. Last year in this corresponding game, the first time I ever saw or faced Siddeley, the first ball was a bumper. I tried a similar shot and it hit my gloves right in front of my nose, so I, that, I was mindful of that. <laughs> but fortunately it's just held up in the wicket a bit. Oh, Gilly, you're back, mate. You're back. <laughs> you're a little tense the first over. Oh, I was. <laughs> Starting to flow now. Sorry to the viewers out there. It wasn't all that much entertainment from, from me, was there? See how we go now. Mate, you've hit it that far, they can't find the ball. That's the good news. <laughs> That's the long side of the ground too, isn't it? Oh, no. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's an opening batsman, isn't he, Tub? <laughs> Board, silly I'm telling you, it's long enough. <laughs> it's still a long, yeah, that's, what, 70 metres? Yeah. Plus into the stand, so you'll take that. Looking beautiful in your pink gear too. Yeah, yeah, we'll uh, hand that over to McGrath at the end of the game and let the foundation go to work on some sort of auction. All right. Siddle around the wicket once again. Oh, he's gone short again. Not only over the bat of Gilchrist, it's over the head of Haddon. Well, this is a big over. It's going to be all-stars. Yeah, yeah. 14 off the over so far. Oh, I know. about the current paceman giving it to the ex-players? Short bowling at great pace in the charity match.